suck on my chocolate salty balls. Scream loud. Put them in your mouth and suck them. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome to Food Review UK, my name's MJ and today I'm reviewing a couple of products that I bought from a Taste of the States. No, it's called Taste of the States, not a Taste of the States. Get it right. These are both from hers. Tried some of these similar products recently. I tried the cotton candy balls and I liked them but they were a little bit disappointing because uh, I'm not sure how well the very intense and sweet taste of cotton candy went with a corn snack. So. I've got these ones, s'mores and funnel cake, and I'm hoping that the flavour is going to go better with these because these are more of a sweet and savoury sort of thing. Like this funnel cake is basically donut. It's where they squeeze the donut, make a thing into a into a oil, and uh, fry it. This big whirling worm cake thing. Um, and s'mores, of course, is biscuit, chocolate, marshmallow. Uh, I'm going to go for the s'mores first because it's the one that I was. Um, less excited for. I'm, I'm hopeful for funnel cake, I really am. Um, yeah, I just I hope the flavour is intense enough. Oh my god, it smells good. It smells like chocolate marshmallow, which, uh, you know, that bodes well. Uh, oh, they don't look super heavily flavour powdered actually. When you look at them in the bag, because they're all together, they do sort of look quite brown, don't they? Especially in this terrible lighting. Um, but up close and personal, they don't look very heavily flavoured. I think this could be a cotton candy situation all over again. Mm. Oh, the flavour powdering's really good. There's just not enough of it again. Yeah, same thing. Exactly the same thing with the cotton candy. Flavour's not strong enough. Oh, oh, but the coating is so good. It is milk chocolatey. And sweet and marshmallowy. Does it get a bit better when you have more than one? Mmm. Yeah. Yeah, you definitely want to put a couple in your mouth at once. Oh, that's nice. It probably is better than the cotton candy, actually. Oh. I just had a heavily dusted one. Yeah. Those are definitely better. Also, the more you eat, the better as well. The flavour builds up. Light, crispy, crunchy. And great flavour. Definitely does taste of a milky chocolate and marshmallow. I'll give that a very solid four stars. Right, next up, funnel cake. Is it really going to taste like funfair fried donut? I hope so, guys. But I do not know. <sighs> Smells interesting. Oh, yeah, definitely smells of the funfair a little bit. I'm not sure if uh, not sure if I can see the flavour dust flavour dusting on this one because uh, it's obviously quite pale. Hmm, quite bland. Hmm, not unpleasant at all. Ooh, ooh, the flavour just snuck through at the end there. Hmm. I'm not sure I explicitly taste donut so strongly or fried dough, but the coating is really nice and sweet. And this one, out of the three I've had. Great fat person voice. Where well, your mouth's filled with balls. Mmm. Here we go. Fat person voice. So, basically, these ones taste the, the most like the flavouring goes all the way through. I don't think that is the case. I think the flavouring is still only on the outside, but this works the best. But it's almost the lightest in flavour. Kind of. It just tastes vaguely sweet and kind of nice. Like, there's like the faintest suggestion of donuts or funnel cake. Um, but they're kind of my favourites. I actually think both, both of these are better than the cotton candy ones. Um, to be honest, I didn't really even finish the cotton candy bag. Whereas these... How many calories is in one? 39 pieces is 140 calories. And the, there's about 240 pieces in here. So it's basically... About 700 or 800 calories in this whole bag. So that is a commitment. But, uh, I really like that as well. I give this a lot of low four stars. But it's, it's also kind of my favourite. So, interpret that as you will, guys. Thanks very much for watching. Thanks for putting up with this 
bloody dreadful lighting. I'm wearing this t-shirt. You can buy it if you want. If you really, really want. Thank you for watching. We've got other American food reviews on the channel. We've got other British food reviews on the channel. We've got food reviews from all around the world. Maybe we should rename ourselves Food Review Worldwide. I've got weird, janky, long arms and I'm waving goodbye to you. Oh my god.